Here we are for sale, our November 2021 on a 71 plate Ford Transit Custom. This is the 320 model, meaning it's got a 3.2 ton gross vehicle weight. This is the long wheelbase or L2 limited double cab van. This one has got the two litre Eco Blue diesel engine and in this particular variant producing 185 PS, roughly 185 brake horsepower. And in this particular model is accompanied with the automatic gearbox. So really the sort of pinnacle of the Transit Custom platform. And what we're gonna do in this video is have a little walk around. I will show you the spec that you get on a uh, limited double cab of this age. We'll also talk you through the optional extras which came on this van from factory. We'll also look at the bits which have been added afterwards and have a really close look at the condition of this example as well. So starting here then at the rear of the vehicle we can see that this one is specced with rear barn doors. So barn doors are two doors which open like so and on a limited you get a number of elements which come color coded that includes the trims here so like this one above the rear number plate trims down the side of the vehicle here the bumpers so the rear bumper the front bumper the mirror caps and the door handles all around all come color coded and when they're in a nice metallic black like this it just sets the vehicle off so so nicely having a look at the condition then of the rear doors and you'll see this is a, a, a sort of a theme that will continue as we go around this particular van it is in absolutely remarkable order very very clean and tidy of course as you would um, like to see or as certainly as we would like to see with uh, this sort of mileage on the vehicle and the age that it is at the moment absolutely stunning condition here at the rear of the van now then a few bits which have been added you can see the first thing which has been added afterwards is this nice rear spoiler here and that ties in very nicely with the rest of the styling so you've got things like the roof bars just there you've got the side bars along the side and we've got these nice 20 inch gloss black caliber t-sport alloy wheels and i think all tied in together it does set it off very well now some optional extras on this particular example at the back here you can see that this one has got a reversing camera so even the limited model which does come with a lot of spec as standard doesn't come with a reversing camera so it's lovely to see that there on the vehicle you get parking sensors so you get rear parking sensors and front parking sensors totally as standard so if we open up the rear doors we can start to have a look inside the back of the van when you open up the rear doors you've got this little yellow arm just there give that a pull you can clip that into place there against the rear door and that allows you to open it up to its full 180 degree position you can do exactly the same with the other door as well and this is now where we can start to have a look at the load space in the rear of this van so this particular vehicle uh, before we had it uh, by the i think when the previous owner bought it actually um, had this nice raptor spray uh, which has been applied to the complete interior of the back of the vehicle so all of the uh, the pillars on the inside here the boards on the side um, as you can see there down the pillars and I say the rear doors all done in this nice Raptor spray uh, which again in, because it's black of course it does get a, give it a very stealth look but the Raptor spray also has um, you know another benefit and that is it's really hard wearing as well um, so it does really uh, say suit this type of vehicle very well where you can be loading items in the back of here and you know that you're nice and protected there in the back the limited as standard comes with this nice non-slip rubber flooring and you also get the fantastic factory fitted bulkhead which you can see there which gives you that separation from the cab to the load space as well running through to another factory optional extra and this one has got the LED load lights there in the back you're not going to see a massive benefit on a day like today where we're in fantastic sunshine here which is quite a rare thing to find in South Wales at the moment but um, in lower light conditions that makes a big big difference you can see there's plenty of tie down points as well in the rear of the vehicle to be able to tie your cargo down but very very nice condition again inside the rear of there let's continue to go around the outside of the van then and have a look at the reflections here down the side of the vehicle and that's really what we're looking for here which is these are the sorts of things you can't particularly pick up in um, in photographs is you know uh, this sort of dynamic angles looking for any uh, ripples uh, signs of any previous paintwork anything like that but it is looking absolutely stunning down the side of here there was one tiny little pin dent which i can see just here above my finger you can just about see that there in the reflection but absolutely tiny we will have a dent removal specialist have a look at that but as I say, that is very very small otherwise looking absolutely stunning there if we open up 
the passenger side silo and door. This is where we can start to have a look inside the vehicle. And this is where it becomes apparent that we've got more optional extras to speak of here from factory. So this one has got the factory leather fitted. So it's a, a sort of a light gray with a black uh, leather surround. And again, in a vehicle like this, where it's a sort of a premium double cab, I think it suits the van very, very nicely. You've got Isofix compatibility on the two outer seats as well. So perfect for uh, a family vehicle or carrying children in the back of here. Um, plenty of room for them. And then of course, plenty of room in the back then for all of the gear that can come with children as well. Fantastic condition again uh, of the step. Looking at the floor here, nice uh, carpet over mat. And as I say, the floor is carpeted as well, which is as they come from factory but really not a lot to fault it on in the back of here looking very smart indeed if we open up the passenger door then we can start to have a look inside the front of the cab so hopefully you can see here we're in as a lot of direct sunlight today but that is uh, in immaculate condition there the uh, dashboard is looking very good the tiniest of little sort of superficial marks just there to the dashboard but otherwise all looking absolutely spot on if we look at the front seats then again of course the leather continues then into the front seats i think this is a really nice option to have on the transit customer you don't see this very often but it does set the van off nicely you have got storage of course underneath the front seats so you can flip those forward and that gives you a nice big bit of storage under there and that's one of the benefits of having a six seater over a five seater is you do get access to this fantastic storage we always put an aftermarket wheel brace in with the correct um, wheel nut size when fitting these uh, alloy wheels so that if you were to have a puncture you can get of course the wheels off nice little fold down tray in the middle there a couple of cup holders and somewhere to store some paperwork as well we'll come around to a bit more of the spec when we go around to the driver's side just there but again, absolutely fantastic condition in there. Really not a lot that I can fault it on. If we start to move around to the front of the vehicle, we can see the passenger side mirror, mirror cover there. No issues there at all. Uh, let's have a closer look at these alloy wheels. As I say, these are a 20 inch gloss black caliber T-Sport alloy wheel. We fit these to a lot of vehicles. Of course, they are load rated with load rated tires. Uh, so all absolutely brand new. So you don't need to worry about treads or curbing or anything like that on those. Moving then around to the front of the vehicle we can see that this one has also been treated to the Ford Trail front grille which just absolutely transforms the front of the vehicle in my opinion. The Limited does come with these headlights here which gives you a nice LED daytime running light around the outside. You also get front parking sensors as standard on the Limited and front fog lights which also act as cornering lights. So when you're turning a corner, so if you're turning right here, um, that will illuminate to uh, help you around the corner you can also see there's a nice front splitter on there as well again which just ties in very nicely with the rest of the styling on the vehicle and i think that looks absolutely stunning in terms of condition here to the front one or two very minor stone chips which have been touched in in the correct metallic black but otherwise there's not a huge amount to fault it on and then finally looking down the outside of the vehicle just having a look down the driver's side here and again this is where i just like to look in those reflections and i'm pleased to say that it's all looking very good there's no signs that i can see here of any uh, previous repairs it's looking very smart i'm going to look at the rear seats from this angle as well very very good condition indeed moving then into the driver side here is a lot of spec here that you get as a driver on the limited model so looking at the driver's step all in fantastic order this is the correct placement of the toolkit behind that door just there so that's where you'll find your jack etc on top of the driver's door then we've got electric windows we've got electric folding mirrors and that's how those are operated just there by pulling that dial back towards you like so you get auto activated lights and auto activated wipers on the limited model two full remote keys come with a vehicle and that's normal flip key that you get leather multifunctioning steering wheel lovely to see that there's uh, little to no sign of any wear on the steering wheel here as of course you'd expect left hand side of the steering wheel you've got your cruise control settings and your volume for the radio on the right hand side you've got your onboard computer controls just there and you can also answer and hang up the phone as well if we look at the dashboard 13,525 miles so really lovely low miles you can see it's all idling correctly there no warning lights or anything like that on the dashboard and finally then having a look here at the driver's seat it's the only seat that we haven't really looked at yet there's more optional extras to speak of so as i say not only we've we got the leather but we've also got an electrically operated driver's seat so you've got uh, backwards and forwards adjustment there you can go up and down 
of course you've got your back uh, your backrest as well of course and uh, this is lumbar support as well so you really get in a nice comfortable position there but that again is quite an unusual option to see on these vans but uh, very nice to see and there's actually another factory extra as well if we go underneath the handbrake here there is a three pin 230 volt uh, socket down there if we look into the center then we've got the automatic gearbox which uh, is becoming more and more popular in these uh, double cab models it's more of the sort of the premium option um, definitely feel like you're driving something quite special when you've got the automatic gearbox just there in the center then air conditioning heated wing mirrors heated windscreen and heated seats all comes completely as standard on the limited model and you can see here in the center you get the sync 3 screen which gives you apple carplay because i've got my uh, phone plugged in here at the moment you've got also android auto on there as well you can use things like of course your uh, your Apple Maps. You can, of course, navigate by Google Maps or Waze if you want to. You can listen to all your favourite music on wh whatever platform that you've got on your phone, basically. So, in this case, it's Apple Music. It could be Spotify. You can listen to your podcasts on there. Absolutely brilliant system to use. Of course, you have got DAB Radio on here. If you, you know, anyway, if you don't want to listen to uh, any of those uh, medias, um, and of course, you can see here you've got your reversing camera display just there as well. Another. USB point and a 12 volt socket down there as well. So hopefully you can tell there is a tremendous amount of spec which comes as standard on the limited model but then this particular example also comes loaded with a whole host of factory options including the leather, the electric driver's seat, the reversing camera, the 230 volt power converter, the LED load lights. It really is a very very well spec van and of course all of the beautiful styling options which have been added afterwards as well and including that lovely Raptor lining in the back. This vehicle has been through our workshop as well during our preparation even though it's not due a service at the moment we have done an oil and filter service just as uh, you know just for a peace of mind really um, and a, a, of course a full health check so it's got a lovely clean bill of health which of course we can provide that to you uh, with the vehicle as well. We can of course offer delivery on all of our vehicles uh, nationwide we can offer finance at very competitive rates and we can take cars or vans in part exchange so please bear that in mind if you'd like to see the full advert if you haven't seen already please have, head over to our website which is there bridgeendvans.co.uk and we'll of course welcome inquiries if you'd like to call us on either of the numbers listed there at the bottom left of the sign of course there's a number of ways you can contact us via the website as well and many social media channels also thank you very much for taking the time to watch today. We'll look forward to hearing from you.